Well, hello there, everybody, and welcome back to Zeus. Zeus. Somebody told me that it's pronounced like Zeus, but with an R, so I'm going with Zeus, like, you know, literally just Zeus with a fucking R. So, with that said, um, let's go check out our unlocks real quick. Developments. What the fuck is sources? Oh, there. That's that. Projects. Oh. I don't think I want to look at that yet. I don't want to get spoiled too quickly. Five achievements required to go to the next level. Okay, so... The village people are really hard to get. So, alright, with this out of the way, with, you know, looking at that out of the way, let's start up a new game, and I've kind of got an idea on what I'd like to do this time. Now, mind you, it's going to take a little bit more planning than the last one, and, uh... Punish them with earthquakes or mug bombs when they start to threaten you. Well, plan to. The little snobs want to get all bitchy, might as well. Okay, so we can either, uh... Hmm, actually, at Chosen People kinda is... What I was thinking about doing, so... Forest Tribe, finish an era with a forest village which has a hundred village prosperity. Um, I'm thinking about going with the chosen people thing. Yeah, I think that that's actually kind of spot on with what I wanted to do. So, let's go over here, kind of away from all these fertility boost things. We're going to make an ocean right here, and then we're going to wait for that to get all panned out. I kind of wish, um, one thing that I do wish was changed about this game, um, was that there are a speed up button. So to say, like a, uh, like, wh like while I'm waiting for him to run, I could just, you know, like, hit a button down here, and then it would go faster. And that'd be really fucking cool, and it'd be really, really helpful. So, you know, whatever. I really don't, it's, I mean, it's really not necessary, <laughs> per se, but, uh, it would be nice. It would actually be very, very, very nice. Alright, so we're gonna have him start a... Water thing here. Actually, I don't think I'm gonna go for the chosen people. Um, I really don't. I, I, I know it would probably be really beneficial to do so, but I'm gonna have him move down here and have him make a swamp. Have this guy make a forest, and this will be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. I think that's how far it needs to be. Hold on, let me count this again. So, one, two, I fucked up already. I'm pretty sure it's that. If not, who the fuck gives a shit? Alright, so we'll have him make a water thing right here. I really hope I did the numbers on this right, otherwise I'll have to undo it. But if I have to undo it, so fucking be it. I don't really give a shit. Also, we'll have this guy move down a little bit. Now, I'm probably gonna have to make a lot of use out of, uh, the water guy's aurora thing this time, simply because of the way that this I'm going to do things with this one. So it's kind of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. This is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Alright, I actually did right. Huh, the diggity daffodil. So, what we're going to do here is we're going to plant that down. Um, cast Aurora. Because I'm really tired. I, I really don't want to have to wait for you to move. Okay, so we'll move him down here. Well, and it hits everything, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10... Ah, fuck, I lost my place. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 10... Okay, I didn't lose my place. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Right the fuck there, good. Alright, so with that said... Um... Kind of literally... We're literally splitting the worlds into thirds. So that way we can have one big swamp area, 
one big forest area, and then we'll do something with the desert there, but eh, it shouldn't be that bad. Alright, so you make a swamp. Desert area, I think, is going to get gypped a little bit as far as space goes, but eh, whatever. They can deal with it. They can fucking dig it. I don't give a shit. Okay, so there we go. Now, Rockman... He, like I said, he is probably going to get gypped on a little bit of space. Now, can I raise a mountain literally right here next to the water and have it not fuck with the water? Because if so, that'll give us more desert space. I, w I want to see how this works. Uh-huh. Okay, so we'll have to do that twice, but that's no big deal. And then that'll start turning this area here in the center into a desert. Hopefully. So we'll raise that right there. Alright, so that means we can start working on... Um... You know what? That's not a good sign. That's not a good sign at all. Okay, maybe, maybe not. Maybe... Maybe back the fuck up. Oh, no, 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 no. All right. Raise your mountain right there. Okay, so this is a learning experience for everybody. Okay, it seems that the planet is doing fine, but not really advancing much further. You can always make villages in bigger to increase prosperity. All right. You go over there. Okay. I wasn't really expecting that, of all fucking things, but whatever. Alright, so if that's the case, we'll start working on the Swamp Village so the uh, game doesn't start getting, uh, having a bitch fit. So we'll put some th uh, herbs right there. And then we'll throw down some exotic animals over here, and hopefully get a nomad really soon. We do have a nomad, by the way, so... There's that. Okay. Alright, the swamp is settled. And that's good. Right? I wish he had settled more over here. But, uh. To make use of this massive area that I'm giving him, but whatever. Okay, so. I love how there's just a little bump right here. Okay, make the mountain right there. The school challenge. Wow, that was fucking quick. Alright, you make fruit right here. I don't know why it gives me a thing that says I shouldn't, but whatever. Alright, now if that's going to be what's going to happen, have you cast that right here? Have this guy start moving up here? That should increase his speed. Alright, so they got the school challenge started. They need 15 technology and 5 food in use. Wow, really? 15? 15 food. That's, that's odd. Child labor, 15 wealth and 15 tech for each mineral within borders. That's, that's, uh, that's something. I'll give it that. That is definitely, that is definitely actually kind of funny. I like that. I like that game. Thank you. Made my fucking day. Okay, so, goddamn you were quick. Alright, so we'll put down some herbs right here. That desert. See, see, the desert gets a little smaller than the other two. Alright, the forest village has settled. Forest villages often start producing projects that require food. Try using fruit plants and domestic animals. Because I, I kind of help with, gotta help with these guys first. Okay, so this is oil roots. Tomatoes gain extra technology. So we'll give them uh, leaf aspect. Lesser growth aspect, hunt aspect, fruit aspect. Do you have growth aspect? Who has growth aspect? Hold on. Herd aspect, crystal aspect. The fuck? Wait a minute. Oh, he does. Ha! Huh. Okay, so we'll give him that. It produces extra tech when having enough food, so that means we need to put a thing of food next to it. There we go. Symbiosis. Plus seven food and plus seven natura next to it. Thang nest. Oh yeah, we can have it two technology. 
Yeah, why the fuck not? Lesser leaf aspect. Go for that shit right there. That's pretty much perfect right there. Yeah, yeah, that, that's perfect. All right, we'll do another uh, leaf aspect too, just so it'll produce a little bit of extra stuff. There we go. So that's gonna be enough technology. And uh, we'll I'll throw the growth aspect on you. So let's start having you move down here. Rockman just isn't really doing a goddamn thing. So we'll, we'll have him go throw down a uh, a rock or something. I don't know. You do you do something. I'm no longer going for the chosen people thing. I don't even know why I'm building a big swamp village or even focusing on the swamp village. But uh, obviously there's going to be a reason. I'm Pat. I have my reasons. All right, throw down another one of those. We'll throw down a second one too. There we go. Let's move everybody. Start move. Let's start moving everybody down here. So we can start focusing on these guys. These guys already started a project, a school. Wait a minute. Oh, okay. Well, whatever. <laughs> whatever. I mean, if they want to do a school, let them do a school. No, no point in not having a bunch of them. All right, there we go. That makes everybody move faster. I'm gonna really need to like spam the fuck out of that because that is a really really nice ability okay so let's go over here upgrade th these they're close to animals oh we don't have lesser fruit aspect do we ha <laughs> okay um if they're close to certain other plants next to dandelions and strawberries okay so that means we're gonna put down a little bit more yeah, we'll just put down, put it down, yeah, right there, and then we'll upgrade it, and for these guys, we're going to go throw down some technology. Alright, nature is looking promising, but it could do even better. Have you tried making use of Simba? Yes, shut the fuck up. I'm just, I just had a slow start, because I was kind of curious on how to do everything. Back the fuck up, game. Come on. Um, I don't think it's getting the symbiosis thing, but whatever. Alright, so they should have enough stuff for that. It'll just take them a second. Um, the Swamp Ambassador has appeared. He can upgrade the following abilities. Ah, uh, the Migrate thing looks dumb. But, uh, the rest of them aren't that bad. So let's throw down an Aurora, have him start moving over there to pick up the Ambassador. I don't see any poison not to get at least one aspect on everybody, because the to toxic aspect seems really nice. All right, the blue damn clam, is, uh, blue damn clam, the blue damn clan has started. Duh. There we go. Advanced minerals. Yeah, well, there's any advanced minerals right here. Have you guys start producing a bunch of shit? Alright, now what did they start? They need 30 wealth in use, and uh, they definitely have that. So, I'm just gonna let them, uh, I'll throw down another precious minerals. Wait, 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 wait. Next to another quartz. And is this, that's what this is, right? So, oh, fuck it, we'll just override this one. There we go. That's a lot of wealth. They'll like that. They'll like that a lot. Hopefully that doesn't make them greedy as fuck. Okay, so this guy's got toxic aspect now. So what can we upgrade these things to? Lesser growth aspect, and lesser toxic. Mineral enriched ground. Actually, let's try that out. I want to try something with this. Um, Rockman, we need you over here. Throw down in another Aurora. See, I mean, if we can just cast this over and over, I don't see the point in why they... You know what, never mind. Okay. Forest aspect. Forest giant. There we go. You take him. Take that bitch. I don't even really want to I don't really want to argue with this guy. I mean he he gets the be, he gets the best growth thing, so I don't see why the fuck not to get it for him. Okay, so I'll just throw down a plant right here. I'll upgrade that with the fruit aspect. They're close to animals. The desert ambassador has appeared. Damn, we are smoking through this. 
Okay, so we'll upgrade that to an apple tree. Plant is still locked. God, that looks disgusting sometimes. Okay, so mineral enriched ground. We will throw down an advanced mineral right here. I hope, I mean, I hope that works right. I hope that's the right way to do this. Yes, it is. Okay, so Rockman, you need to go back over here and pick up your ambassador. Throw down another little Aurora for our rocky friend. I mean, just look how much faster he gets. I actually don't think uh, uh, he's getting that much faster. Alright, looks like one of your villages is getting quite greedy. Which one is it? Not this one. This one? Yeah, it's that one. There's not a lot I can do. I can throw a muck bomb at him. I mean... That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Alright, trade post. So we're gonna have to do something that would inspire all. Oh. All? Oh, yes, all. Oh. The swamp village has settled. Wait a minute, what? Oh god, no, I was just hoping to have one big village that would span the whole fucking thing. I don't wanna have to fucking manage, like, oh god, we're gonna have to manage a lot of villages. The giants are growing stronger and stronger, however it seems, we've already read this. Okay, well, um, calm your tits, guys. Here we go. Alright, so we'll have this guy move down here. These guys are starting to get a little bit greedy, but uh, nothing too serious at the moment. Oh my god, what thing did they start? They got need 30 technology in their borders. Okay, you, throw down an Aurora. Okay, now let's see if it really does increase their speed. Huh. I don't even know. Okay, so they're going to need some technology. So we'll just override these plant things right here. They don't need them. Perfect. Okay, now what can we upgrade these to? We can upgrade it to marshmallows. And we just got an auto save. Thank God, right? I mean, what would we do without it? Okay, so we'll do a toxic aspect on that. Yeah, all is the way to prevent that kind of crap. Oh, and we have a potent leaf aspect. Hey, you got you get the fuck over here. Are they still greedy? Who was it that was being greedy? These guys? No, it was these guys. Uh, I don't know. They feel, they still respect the giants, so I don't know. Okay, so we need a potent leaf aspect to upgrade this. I think this will be nice. Okay, so we'll uh, use the fertility boost on it. Alright, and then the potent leaf aspect. Hopefully we'll get that. Hell yeah! White Willow can create a mangrove of Natura and Tech with other plants. Nice. Hell yeah, we'll just do another one right here. Because that's within their borders. And then we'll throw that down. And then we'll upgrade that to Marshmallow. And then we'll... Yeah, we'll just fill up. We'll just fill that up. So I think these villages are going to be a little too close to each other. I'm really regretting this decision. To put them close to each other. I didn't, I didn't think it would. I was hoping that it would settle in the middle. And we could just have a large village. Because the more we did stuff with each village, the larger it got. And I was hoping it would do something like that. But, obviously fucking not. So, whatever. Alright. So, these guys are a little bit greedy. These guys are getting less greedy. Which is, which is good. I would rather them not be greedy at all. Okay, so let's keep on working with this village over here. I want to I keep trying with this. Okay, so you can throw down another herb. 
Okay, and Toxic Plant Aspect. These guys are going to have a massive amount of tech. Yeah, they are already overshadowing that village next to them. That's that's pretty scary, actually. Okay, so let's do this one. Potent Leaf Aspect? Oh, wait, we gotta we actually got to do it. The University Challenge has started. Well... And we did get the potent leaf aspect. Hot damn! They are getting really greedy. But you'd think that they all would offset it, right? Okay, the swamp ambassador has appeared. You can upgrade the following abilities. I kind of want the rock giant to get this guy. Yeah, but he already has one. Looks like we're getting that one. Hurt aspect. Fine. I can dig it. Also, don't these cause awe? No, they don't. If next to an animal nest, we're going to need to get awe. Because these guys are going to get really greedy really quick. Maybe we can just kind of hope for a leaf aspect. No, I'm not going to risk it. Okay. Um. I mean, they can always bitch slap these guys before they get too strong, but, uh. Neat. Okay, so you get the herd aspect. Which adds food. So let's add some exotic animals over here. And hope and pray that they fucking add awe when we add the his hurt ability to them. Alright. So lesser predator, lesser herd. It gives more if they're close to plants. Okay, yeah, we might be giving giving them a little greedy. Okay, the barracks challenge. The barracks challenge. Do I really want to go? I don't even know. Fine, we'll upgrade it to that. That's fine. Whatever. Plus three food next to other plants. Okay, well let's have you upgrade this. I kind of want to bitch slap these guys. That's why I'm actually upgrading this a lot. Because I do want to. I actually do want to destroy them. Customs house has started. All right, and what do they need? They need a, a hundred wealth and forty food. Okay, can we upgrade this to the willows? There we go. They have a ninety-nine tech. Okay, now you use that. All right, so we need to go over here. I think we actually have multiple challenges. This challenges started. And we have the barracks challenge right here, which needs... They're going to need more food. Oh, it's the customs house. And then... They're going to need more food over here. They have... They don't actually have enough of anything, so... We're going to need to get everybody over here as quickly as we can. We'll just leave this greedy ass village to their uh, own devices. Actually, you know what? Throw down muck bomb. There we go. That should ha that should calm their tits down a little bit. Doing seven damage over seven seconds. Doing reduced damage to villages. That should calm their tits a little bit. All right, so these guys are going to need more wealth and more food. So let's throw down. Um, this right here. All right, perfect. Okay. So we're gonna need lesser seismic aspect, and we only have the noble aspect. So might actually be a good idea to um, maybe go with food on this one. Domestic animals, yeah, there we go. Okay, hold on, wait a minute. Um, and plus five off next to a plant. Ah, actually, you know, back up, back up. Maybe maybe doing the plant thing isn't all that bad. We're just gonna have to figure out exactly what we're gonna do with this. This plant seems like it's gonna be pretty shitty. Okay, so we can either do next to other plants. Gives more tech, but we need wealth actually. So, we will use, give you more food, yeah, so we'll do the fruit aspect. 
All right. There we go. When we need to put another thing of food root next to it, right? And then we're also going to have to go onto the other side and start adding some other stuff. See, yeah, see, there we go. That's perfect. So once we actually have food added to this, the gave, that's going to be two twenty. Eh. Meh. We'll add the fertility thing to this, because I think that one got a potent. Yeah, yeah, it did. Okay, so all we have to do is just add a... Mm, potent fruit thing, and it should be fine. Okay, so yeah, that's, there, that's that solved. And then for over here... If next to another quartz, so we'll just go add a, we'll just go add another precious mineral over here, or two, yeah maybe two. Yes, yes, I like that. Hmm. It'll give these all the mineral aspect. Also, we'll just throw down a little muck bomb just to make sure these guys know their place. Fuck you, little bitches. I always feel like that helps with the, the greed thing. These guys are getting real greedy. These guys are fucking really greedy. Prosperity. Prosperity. Wait, this village has won a war? Hmm. Wow, they have negative 10 off. So these guys have gone to war. Okay, so we need to go help these guys over here. So these guys are going to need more food, wealth, and technology. Honestly, I'm thinking about destroying these guys. I'm really, I'm really, yeah, I'm going to destroy, I'm going to destroy those guys. I don't see the point. It'll let this village grow faster. And, uh, yeah. I don't see any point in having two villages over here. Two, two, two of the same kind of village. Anyway. Okay, these guys are also going to need more food. So we need to send you... Hold on, where are you? You two. Together over there, so... We will just go ahead and destroy this village. No harm, no foul, guys. I mean, I, I feel like it would be for the best. Game auto saved. Yeah, thanks, game. You know exactly what I'm about to do. Alright, go ahead, guy. It's too bad. I can't even stop it halfway through. Yep, they've been destroyed. And that village already expanded a little bit. Perfect. Alright, so let's go over here. These guys are in desperate need of... What do they need? They need food. So, how big is their village? we got plenty of space to work with. We'll throw down some fruit right here. God dang, you're fast. A small village has been settled. Oh, you done fucked up, guy. Except, well, we gotta kind of got some uh, time to wait there, so, never mind. Alright, so we can upgrade that to tomato. Oh, well, fuck it. We'll just do the... We'll just upgrade that to apples. Why the fuck not? Apple tree! The school challenge has started. Okay, so yeah, they... Uh, they're not gonna be fine just yet. So how's their greed? Who started the school challenge? These guys. I feel bad for killing two villages in a row. Alright, the Desert Ambassador has appeared. He can upgrade the following abilities. Wait a minute, Noble Aspect. Don't you already have the Noble Aspect? Yes, he does. Hold on. Let's pause this again. Okay, what would you get? He would get Monsoon. Don't really need that. He would get Haunt Aspect. Eh, that doesn't sound too bad. Yeah, I'll get that. Call, uh, throw a little danger into the mix. Actually, hold on. He can wait. We need to. We need to keep upgrading this crap over here.
Let's also throw down a fertility boost. And then a fruit aspect. And then this apple tree thing should be fine. Wait a minute. Next to an animal's nest? What the fuck? I missed I messed up! No, it's next to an Oh, next to an animal's nest. Oh, so that's what you go you hey okay, okay, never mind. I I, I got mixed up there. I know what I know I know what I must do. Okay, so you throw down some domestic animals. There we go. Okay, so we will throw down the herd aspect. Turn that into rabbits. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll give it a second one. There we go. Perfect. Also, can you can you destroy this village now? Good. I mean, I'll, I'll just keep destroying these villages. If they keep planting them here, I'm going to keep destroying them. Because these guys are just going to go to war over and over. There we go. These, I, I hope I'm doing the right thing here. Chances are I'm not. But what do I know? These guys are getting a little greedy, too. Have a single destroyed home. Have this customs house. <laughs> He's patting his guys up there. Good job, guy. All right. All right. What does this village need at the moment? Go to them, damn it. God, when it's paused, it's all weird and whatnot. Oh, well, these guys need to finish the university. I haven't been paying any attention to these guys. I'm so sorry. All right, what they're going to need is more food and uh, more wealth, so... Okay, when it's paused, it's really weird. So, you start putting these down. Put it on the herd aspect. Luckily, this guy settled right in the middle, so there's no room for other villagers. So, upgrade that to rabbits. Should be plenty of food, although that might make them a little greedy, but that's fine. Okay, so we need to come over here. There we go, zoom in on that. Very, very slowly. Alright, so we got these two tomato things over here. We can make them into white will- yeah, we can actually make them into white willows. With the potent leaf aspect. So we'll probably do that. And that'll give them the tech in? Mostly just the tech. It'll actually take away their food. Okay, if that's gonna be the case. How big's their area? We'll give these guys rabbits, because rabbits seem like they are fucking awesome. Okay, the swamp... Go up here and knock some sense into these fools. Oh, wait a minute, you don't have to do that, never mind. Yeah, don't do that. Let's just, let, just let the rock man do it. There we go. Oh, wait, we can make rabbits here. Oopsies! All right, the project is close to running out on time. Yeah, it's three minutes. I think I think we can get this done in three minutes. All right, so frog things apparently not what we wanted, and give more of close to plants. Okay, yeah, we can do this. Warcliff has been destroyed. Okay, the school challenge is. Oh wait, nah, haha, -ha, no, no, it hasn't actually. Okay, so we'll upgrade these to otters. To the otters. And then upgrade this with the lesser toxic aspect. How much do they need? 60? Okay, good. So let's go add some fruit plants right here. Hmm. Yes. Yes, indeed. Okay, so that's going to give them more food near mineral enriched ground okay so we'll do the fruit aspect here and then we'll have this guy give what do they need still they still need wealth so we will give them precious minerals yes yes we will do especially well around mineral enriched ground hey we can actually upgrade this steel 
Get more food and all. Huh. Wow. Okay, so... Okay, so yeah, we'll just use the noble aspect on that, so because it's close to uh, the plants, it'll do well. The giants are starting to lose their energy. Wow, this actually went by really quickly. That's surprised. Okay, do we actually have enough stuff for all of this? Oh, more than enough. We just actually have to, to be there to get it. Okay, so let's throw down a fertilized thing here. Alright, and then we'll throw down a fruit aspect. And then a nature aspect, or a leaf aspect. There we go. Perfect. He's already lost his energy. He's going to sleep. I want to got off one more good ground pound. Just for just for the shits and giggles of it. All right, this poor this poor desert village over here never really got a lot accomplished. I kind of feel bad for them. But I think we did get the uh, the forest tribe thing, and I think we might have gotten the desert tribe one too. Oh, most definitely. Good, and we didn't get chosen people, but eh, it doesn't really matter. Alright, so we got those two. Classical era. Finish an era with 450 prosperity. Oh, yeah. Um. Yeah, and we already got all this stuff, so there we go. Hope everybody enjoyed this playthrough of Ryus, and it's pretty similar to the last one, actually, but we unlocked these two. We're doing a lot better each time, which is, which is good. And I really do think that going with the, uh... I will continue. Yeah, I can continue this in free play. I just want to talk about this a little bit. This double thing is really a really really good idea. So they're not asleep anymore, right? Okay, so let's pause this. Um, I th I do really think as a strategy for this game, going with um like just just this strategy right here, where you have the three oceans, you have the large forest area, the large swamp area and then the large desert area is single-handedly the best way you can go about this bar none I can't even I can't even imagine no matter what else I may learn about this game I can already see this as being the way to go on this now obviously that may have been obvious to some people now uh, that may have been obvious to some people already who have played this but still and I do say that when you set it up try to set up like with this one I set the first um, I set the uh, first mineral right here, or first source thing right here, and it made the village spawn here. And that's kind of what I fucked up with this village over here, that caused so many issues, god damn it, camera, is I set the first mineral like right here, or right here or some shit, and then the village spawned here. It always seems to spawn to the left of where you make the first mineral. That's why when I made this one, I made this right here, village spawned here. So. Keep that in mind, if I had set the, the first mineral right here, the village probably would have started there in the middle, and I wouldn't have had to worry about anything, so keep that in mind when you're setting this stuff up. Also, if somebody in the comments or as a message or some shit will tell me, can you make minerals in the ocean? Actually, let's test that now. Uh, no you can't. Had to try. Because I was thinking, like, maybe, like, I mean, it said somewhere a long time ago. Can we make animals now? Hey, we can make, actually, we can make animals here. So, yeah, because, I, I mean, I remember hearing very, very early on in this game that all the, all the races can make canoes or kayaks or some stupid shit. I remember it saying something about that. Now, at the point, the point is, if it's really close to the ocean... They can get food. There we go. Yeah, see, there we can actually make animals out in the ocean. Can this guy make animals out in the ocean? Yes, he can. Can he make herbs? He can make herbs out in the ocean. So we cannot. We can't make minerals out there. But so I mean, even if you are close to the ocean and you you know do get some ocean stuff, go destroy them. Yeah. So what can they make? Um. What did he make? I don't think he made anything. 
That's a little odd. Okay, so what did he make? He made clownfish. Okay, so making fish is a is a thing. That's really not all that surprising. I don't know why I'm as surprised as I am, but still. Okay, then. Also, what's his um, aggressive ability? Migrate. He actually does not have an aggressive ability, which is kind of odd. Okay, so let's try this again. I actually do want... Actually, before we end this off, I do want to see what he makes. Because it looked like he just added a stick to the fucking... Yeah, all he does is add a stick to the surface. You lazy motherfucker. Okay, now what about... What about you, grass man? What can you do over here? He... He can add it close to the surface, but he can't actually add it in the water. So we'll see what he makes. It'll probably be something... I actually I actually have no idea. He just adds a fucking stick. So there's that. Okay, like I said, I hope everybody enjoyed this episode of uh, Roos, and I'll see you guys next time. Have fun out there, everybody. Yeah, I need water. Been talking for too long today. Aww.